We got some really quick Yankee breaking news. Yankees have recalled Miguel Andujar from Triple A, so he's gonna be on the Major League squad. Now Andujar has been annihilating the baseball in Triple A. In 49 at bats, he's hit 347. He's had an <clears throat> OPS of 947. He's been walking a good amount. He's been hitting for a good amount of power, hitting doubles. He's been doing everything right. And hey, Andrew Har's a guy who has a crazy good bat. He was second in Rookie of the Year voting in 2018. He hit 297 that season with 27 home runs. He was really good. He just could not field at all. I mean, he, he cannot play third. He can't really play left field. He's, he just can't field anywhere. So I think it's going to be very interesting to see what the Yankees do with him. They have him as a guy on the bench who they call up to pinch hit. If they maybe have him as the designated hitter. Because they can do that. If you have Stanton playing the field, you have <clears throat> Stanton in left, Judge right, Gallo center. Give Hicks the day off. You know, you can have Andrew Hart as the designated hitter. And that can be a sneaky good bat in there. We'll also have to see the corresponding move for the Yankees. I think, personally, that they're going to send down um, Ron Marinicio, the pitcher. Again, the Yankees don't really need him at the moment. The bullpen is absolutely stacked, and he's very young. He has, a, another, he has minor league options. He's been pretty solid for us, but the bullpen's really good. We need the offense to be picking back up. I think he'll be sent down, but... I'm excited to see what Andrew Hart can do with the Yankees. I wish he can hit. Hope his glove plays. If he can just be an average defender. Not average. If he can be a not horrendous defender. But it hit at the rate that he hit in 2018. It will be fantastic having him back. So that's your little bit of Yankees news there. Miguel Andujar is back on the, on the roster.